Hey, Accidental Spiritualist here, and I'm really excited. Today was my day off, and I got a delivery of something I had ordered off of Amazon. And a friend and I are getting ready to go to a regional burn. It's going to be our first burn. Neither one have ever been to one. If you don't know what a regional burn is, it is sanctioned off of the original Burning Man. And if you don't know what that is either, then I will let you Google that and find out what it's about. But anyway, this burn we're going to is going to be totally primitive camping. And we have to take all our own stuff. And so we've been working on trying to figure out how we're going to do things. And one of the things I was worried about was getting my morning coffee. And... Here at home I have a Keurig, which I absolutely adore, but I had come up with a way to get some coffee in the morning. You know, I like all my frou-frou creamers and flavors and everything. So, but anyway, I had found this little Sterno burner, which I got off of eBay. You know, gotta love eBay. And... What it does here is it folds up completely flat and you just assemble it and it takes a little finagling to get it assembled here, but it does go together. And it has a little door here on the front. You set a little sterno inside there. And close your little door and then I had bought this little pot that will sit right on top of that and it will heat my water for me and I bought this from just a little surplus camping store you, know, you can pick these up little coffee pots or teapots anywhere and so I thought I did, you know, and then I was going to heat my water and put it in the cup and and had some Folgers singles. They're like a little tea bag. You just set them down in your hot water and it will steep your coffee there. But, you know, then with no electricity or anything, I was going to have to worry about my creamer getting too warm in a cooler and stuff. And it was just going to make more work. And then I seen on eBay, a friend was talking about, she had just found this and bought it for a camping trip she was going on. And it, you know, she tried it out and said it worked wonderful. And so I had to order me, I've got two of them here. Now so this one I'm keeping to give to a friend as a present. And the other one I've already gotten out and got it washed off it says to wash it thoroughly before you use it the first time and it even comes with one of these little cups here that if you want to put your own coffee in it and make your own cup of coffee that way you know using your own grounds so and so i'm going to try it out for the first time here i heated some water it says just to heat your water here and I've got me a K cup here it is cafe caramel and it says to take the base part here the cup holder and you set your cup in there your K cup and you pop it down on the needle that's inside there and then you screw the water reservoir on and the water reservoir has a little rubber ring on here to keep you from burning your fingers and then it's got can't see it too well but it's got measurements on the side there for the amount of water for the strength that you want and so I'm gonna pour my water in here and then it says to put the pump on the top here and 
pushing on the edge only around the base of the pump. And you've got your pump cap here. I'm going to push that on. And then you set the whole thing on top of your cup. And then holding it firmly. You push down on the pump. And I can hear the cappuccino running into my cup. Took a little bit of pressure to get it started. It's still running. I can still hear it. When it stops, I got me a cup of cappuccino. There we go. It works pretty darn good. I will be able to take all my frou frou curried K cups with me and be able to use them on the burn. So there we have it. And we will talk to y'all later. Bye.